What would you want? I saw you. You were there. Right, I'm busy, so let's get this over with, shall we? Me and Tanya, we're together, OK? No. Not OK, chap. I knew there was something going on, but you lied, didn't you? Why'd you keep doing this? I mean, surely you know you don't stand a chance with Tanya. Or what, you just like banging your head against the wall, do you? <laughs> it's been over a long time, Sean. Like, you can't get over it. You need help. All right? Professional help. What about Roxy? She's pregnant, is she? With your kid? Surely you should be chasing her. I mean, she's the real deal. They won't tell me where she is, Joe. Oh, you're going to give up that easy, are you? Don't sound like you. No. You're right. Oh, and leave Ronnie alone. Oh, oh, what? One woman not enough for you? She doesn't know where Roxy is. Don't believe you. Well, if she did, why would she ask me to find her? Play a game of cat and mouse with me, that's fine. This is private property. Well, what are you going to do? Call the police? I have got nothing to say to no, you. No, I believe you. Just had an interesting chat with your ex. Reckons Roxy's blown you out. What, she finally see the light? Did she manage to unhook your little cause? You don't know anything. I know this. When she gets back, she will. We'll be waiting. We'll see you on. Roxy. Hello? Look, I told you not to come in here. I'll call you back. Oh, and what's this? Round two? No, I called him. Was that Roxy? No, darling, wrong number, sorry. You're unbelievable. You don't even flinch, do you? What? I heard you. It wasn't a wrong number, was it? Ew. You know, I was starting to feel bad about it. Like I might have gone over the top, but no, you you just can't help yourself, can you? Look, you don't understand. You lied to me, and now you're lying to her. You want to help Ronnie? Then tell her the truth. Tell her where Roxy is. <laughs> <laughs>